Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today is Thursday and I'm going to be vlogging. Today's video is definitely more of a mom vlog, just kind of my day with my kids. It's about 7.30, 8 o'clock. Um, Jedediah just finished eating breakfast and we're just kind of hanging out in the living room. So come along with us. Little guy is here playing with his cars and little mama is over here just hanging out. Wide awake. I want to be with me. Little awesome. me. I want to be little me. Go. Go. We ended up coming inside because the sun was starting to come on us a little bit too much. It was getting kind of warm outside, so we came inside. <laughs> um, I'm actually going to make us some smoothies. Say, here, if you're going to talk, take this passy out. Before we do that, I want to tell you guys a little bit about my postpartum. <laughs> Um, to health journey. Um, I wanted to slowly transition my mental state into preparing for like more of a consistent like health journey. So since I had a C-section for my second child, I um, I wasn't going to start working out or doing any sort of exercises or stretches until I was eight weeks postpartum. And um, so at six weeks, I started my healthy mentality healthy mentality. I'm not very, being very strict. I'm not putting myself on a diet. So at six weeks, I stopped drinking calories, which basically means I stopped filling my body with liquids that contained calories. So the only calories I do drink is coffee, tea, and homemade smoothies. At seven weeks is when I stopped or actually I started limiting myself to sweets because after having my daughter I felt like I had a very big like snacking issue. What I started doing to transition to this point where I'm at now is I actually did a two week fast. I no longer allowed myself to eat after 8 p.m. and that really helped me not be able to eat throughout the night. And so this is, and I'm now eight weeks postpartum and I just started exercising. What I'm doing is actually, um, I found out I have ab separation. I think it's called, this. I forgot what it's called, but I'll put it on the screen. And it basically means like when you were pregnant, your abs separated. I have a two finger width separation. So I'm actually doing exercises every day to kind of close that before I fully start working out. Fun fact, Jedediah hates the blender. He sees me getting things out to make a smoothie, he freaks out and just hates it. Do you want to go in your room or do you want me to hold you? Mm -hmm. You want me to hold you? Mm -hmm. Okay. Alrighty. <laughs> Jediah, your smoothie. Yummy, 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 yummy. Smoothie, smoothie. Yours is right here. Yeah. Take your pass, yeah. Smoothie, smoothie. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Cheers. I've always enjoyed making smoothies. Um, Jedediah's at a stage where he isn't really wanting to eat all of his meals. As a mom, I'm just paranoid that he's not getting enough nutrients in his day. And I know this is just temporary, but just to supplement some of the calories and some of the nutrients he would be getting from food, I am kind of been making smoothies every day to give him at least some fruits and veggies inside of his system. And he loves it. Um, he just doesn't like when I have to blend everything up. The entire time I was making the smoothie, little girl over here was knocked out. 
think she's just kind of used to like a chaotic and crazy environment during the day especially with Jedediah he's so outgoing and loud and playful and so she's just used to it being loud in the house You were a handsome little boy, you know that? With your little nappy hair. What are you pointing at, baby? Let's see. Squirrel. It's almost 11. It's like 10.45. I just put Jedediah down to take his nap. He did wake up at 7, so typically his nap time is from 12 to 2. But since I'm going somewhere today that I'm trying to get to by 1, um, that's going to be in the middle of his nap. So I'm trying to take have him take his nap a little bit earlier. Hopefully he takes a good nap, at least if he just rests. Um, Ayla's asleep, so while they're both sleeping, I'm gonna just lay down, watch some YouTube, and rest. I, I just have never heard of that ever, and I don't think I've ever heard of That's like me seeing another comic do a bit on stage and being like, why didn't I think... You said, like, I would love to just continue to relax, but Ayla's gonna be waking up soon to eat, and I know when she wakes up, she'll probably be up for a bit. I'm gonna just sit here, watch the kids, watch my YouTube, and get ready. I'm done for our move because for, for a full year, I love people love to talk about what the fuck I was saying. High key sad, it's so dumb, right? But I just want to know if I'm not alone and take all this out. All right. This is the final look. Very natural, very everyday makeup. I didn't do nothing too crazy. Today is my students' the last day of school. My sub asked if I could be there because my students have been asking about me and wanting to see the baby. So we are going to go visit my class and see my students. That's why I'm getting ready. That's why Jedediah's nap is so early. And for my hair, I'm literally just gonna put it in a ponytail. I don't know if you guys notice, but like on my channel, you'll always see me like either looking a hot mess with my hair or in a wig that still looks a hot mess. But the reason I prefer hot, a hot mess of a wig <laughs> is because I just don't like doing my hair. Like my hair could be braided and I'll just throw a wig on and I don't care how I look as long as I don't have to actually do my hair. I don't like being creative with um, my hairstyles and I don't like putting a lot of product in my hair. All right, this is probably gonna be the end of today's video. We don't have much else to do besides go to my school, do run my two errands, and then when we come back, hang out, cook dinner, and that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.